Okay. Okay. The good thing is we have enough water to get an infinite water pool, therefore we have enough to, you know, sustain a, as as large as a, of a farm as we possibly may ever want. While at the same time, another two more meteors, you kidding me? Oh. Oh my god. Jeez, why isn't Jupiter doing its job just diverting all the meteors away from Earth? That's what it's supposed to do, and it's not doing it. Uh, well, let's keep exploring this direction. And see... Oh, that is a cave. That is a ravine. Hmm. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking here, maybe... Ah. No, I don't think it's worth... Actually, you know what? What does this do? Oh, that feel... Oh my god, that's so cool. Oh, let's go back to the thing. Let's go fill up our little tanks. Oh, this is so awesome. So we can have, like, pretty much unlimited water. Oh, man. How do I, like... Dis like, get the water out of my thing. How do I- how do I do that? Do I do this? Is that what I do? Uh, I don't know. Or do I fill it up like that? Oh, yeah! Okay, oh, okay. Okay, this makes sense now. Okay. Alright, this is cool. Does that show on my F5 too? <gasps> Look at that! There's little, like, water in my little tank down there. You see that? That is so cool. Oh, man, that is so awesome. And you can see my pickaxe there on my backpack too. That is so cool. Alright, let's go fill up our tanks, and I guess, I guess let's head home, because this is really good. We have water now. God, it feels so fantastic to come. Oh, I'm, 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 I, I want to swim in it. I just want to swim. Oh, just drink all this water. Oh, oh, fresh water. So delicious. So delicious. Ugh. Okay, let's put this in our backpack. So how much? Four? I guess I guess it holds four buckets worth of water, and let's fill that one up all the way. God, this is so cool. Uh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's just head back home. Let's just head back home. And I could teleport, but I don't know if you guys are okay with it. So, I guess leave a comment down below if you guys are okay with me teleporting. Y you guys are okay with me teleporting in spacecraft, so I guess it shouldn't be too big of a deal if I teleport in uh, the end of Earth. So let's let's go to this teleport. Two. Is that going to allow me? It doesn't let me. Oh, it doesn't let me anyways, so I guess it's not going to- it doesn't matter. Alright, let's disable that one anyways. Okay, whatever. I guess we can't teleport. Well, let's uh, let's eat some rotten flesh and kill a zombie or two. Come on, zombies, get over here. Come on. Wah! Wah! Yeah! Give me that rotten flesh. <gasps> Is that another civil- no, that's just a- that's just a bunch of random blocks stacked on top of each other, I guess. Whatever. I thought it was another civilization, but I guess not. Okay, there's that other house we came across. This is really cool, okay. Maybe, maybe we should spend more time exploring above ground as much as we explore below ground. Because above ground, there's a lot of treasures, like, right back there we found the only water source probably in the entire map. Uh, we found two or three houses that had, uh, loot inside of them. Which was really good loot, too, because I'm glad we found those houses. They gave us three iron ingots, which was just enough to get another bucket so we can, uh, Get enough water for infinite water pool, which we later found out that we could just put on our backpack. But still, two buckets worth of water. That is so valuable, you guys don't even know. We're getting close. And there is the beacon. I could see it. I could see the beacon going up in the sky. Yep. All right. Well, let's go over here. Let's put down our infinite water pool that I'm oh so proud of. And let's get rid of all this disco. What happens when I do this? Okay, well, I guess it just doesn't interact. <laughs> all right, well... Let's get rid of this disgusting, toxic water. And let's put an infinite water pool here. Delicious and delicious. Mmm. Yeah, you guys are swimming in that. Well, I'm swimming in this. Ho oh, ho! Don't mind if I swim in some of this healthy, regular water. Get out of here, zombies. I don't need your disgusting, nasty day zombie flesh all- Actually, you know what? Keep swimming in that all you want, because that's not going to be around for much longer. Ho oh, ho! All right, well, how much of this we- we have a little bit of dirt. Okay, so there we go. Get rid of this now. There we go. All right. Oh, we can get rid of a pretty good amount of it. Yeah, there you go. Just one more block down there. Yeah, let's get rid of that. Okay. Oh, there's still some toxic water down here. I guess I'll have to fill that up as much as possible. God, there's so much toxic water. Ugh. How much? Okay, I have a little bit of cobble. I, I'm, I guess I get. Oh! Oh, I just fell the god. Oh, he has an iron shovel. I could use that. Give me that iron shovel. Ugh. Get rid of that. Ugh. Okay, zombie's dead. He didn't drop the shovel, though. 
God, why'd I fall on that like a dumb? <laughs> <sighs> okay. All right, let's keep getting this dirt. And let's work on our farm a little bit more. All right. All right. Okay, there we go. Let's keep- let's get rid of the cobblestone down there. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. And then we can get rid of this up here. Yeah, there we go. Okay. I'm liking this so far. Then we just have to break up- Oh, oh, what is that? A heart container? Miniature red heart. Crafting item. Part of low level heart canisters. What is the use of this? Can be eaten to restore 10 hearts. <gasps> now that is useful. Let's put that in here just in case we're in a dire emergency and we definitely need more heart or more health. Like maybe we're fighting something and we have some valuables on us. Maybe like 10 diamonds, something juicy like that. Mmm. That can definitely come in useful in the future, I'll tell you that much. Alright. Let's keep extending our farm. Alright, it shouldn't be too hard. There's uh there's just this little bit over here, and then we have Oh! Then we have a little bit of disgusting toxic water under this, I believe. Right? Or unless I got it all. No, there's a little bit, yeah. Yep, just a tiny little bit. Ho oh, ho, I think it's all gone now. I think it's all gone. Alright. Well, let's replace all this disgusting cobblestone with some delicious dirt. So there we go, that should be one row. Oh, there's something. Oh wait, that's just my- that's just the sound of me walking. I thought something was walking up a- walking up on me, trying to touch my butt. I don't want that to happen. Alright, so there we go. Uh, oh yeah, we need to get rid of all this. So there we go. Then we need to shovel this out before all the crops die. And there we go. Alright. God, I am feeling so good about this. We're, we're getting a pretty good farm set up here and everything. Like, it's so good. Uh... It brings the tear to my eye. Not really. But it does. I can step in this water no problem. It feels so good for me to be able to do that. Oh, it feels so good. Alright, there we go. And we have an infinite thing there. Yep. Yep. And we slowly bring the water over in here. Alright. God, I'm loving this almost as much as I'm loving McDonald's. Still not sponsored. Alright. There we go. So we need to put it here. And break that. God, this water spreads so nicely. Mmm. There we go. And there we go. Alright, so we need to get rid of this, yes. Place some more dirt there. And plant the I think we got wheat seeds back there as well from the either from the the village or one of those abandoned houses, so that can definitely come in useful here in a bit. So let's actually get rid of some of this so we can use for There we go. And let's till a bit a little bit of that. And a little bit of this as well. Alright, I'm liking this. Alright, there we go. So, yeah, we got a little bit of a wheat seeds here. Nice, nice. Do we have any bones we can use? Uh, yeah, we do. Nice. Okay, let's turn those into bone meal. There we go. One, two, one, two. God, three for that one. Ugh. I know it's nighttime right now. Okay, let's place some torches, actually. That reminds me. If we don't want any spooky spookies trying to trample our crops. Oh, man, I need to make... Oh, I need to make, like, fences, but... We have not We have a finite amount of, uh, wood, so I guess I'll make, uh, cobblestone fences instead. Okay, let's plant the rest of these wheat seeds down. There we go. And let's get these carrots growing. There we go. There we go. Get those carrots. Mmm, let's get those carrots. I know there's a zombie behind me, Tra- Oh, he's got some pretty good armor. He's got, like, a sapphire sword. Are you kidding me? Give me that sword! Give me that sword! I need that sword! God, he trampled my crop right there. Are you kidding me? There we go. Give me that. I need that seed. God. Inconsiderate zombies. Uh, I tell you, every single time. These dumb zombies. <laughs> Alright, this should be enough carrots. There we go. And two profit carrots for us to nom on. Oh, man. It's feeling great. It's feeling fantastic. Okay, let's see. Where's that one seed at? There it is. Place that down. And I think we're good to go. Let's go back to our little area here. And there are two Endermen over there. And let's... Let's, let's sleep for the night. Oh, look at that. One of our uh, berry bush thing grew. Nice, nice. Now, I don't remember how you actually, like, do you right click or... Oh, that hurts. God. Ah, oh, I need to stop doing that. <laughs> okay, then... Then we put the backpack there, and then there's our sleeping bag, and let's go to sleep. Oh my god. What? What was that sound? What? Is that... Was that a meteor? 
What was that sound? Right when we went to bed, something went boom. Oh my god. I'm kind of afraid to go out there now. I'm not even joking, I'm kind of afraid to go out there. I don't know if I should. I'm going to, I'm going to eat those two pork chops just for, just for old times sake. Okay, we have a little bit of dirt. Okay, let's... Oh, I'm kind of scared to go to the surface and investigate what happened up there. That was a huge boom. What was that? Is that... It, sure, it, it surely wasn't the volcano. Nothing, nothing news happened with the volcano. Huh. I'm not seeing anything. Oh man, I, I'd hope, I hope another meteor didn't like crash like right here. I don't think so. At least I'm not seeing anything on the minimap. Let's zoom out a little bit. Yeah. I'm not seeing anything new on the minimap. Hmm. Yeah, that was a peculiar sound. Really scary too. Definitely woke me up. Well, I was heading the bed, so I guess it didn't wake me up. Anyways, <gasps> Enderman, stay away from me, Enderman. I don't want to accidentally look at you. I know you're self-conscious about your image, although you are quite slender and sexy looking. I don't want to upset you. All right, zombie, get over here. If you want to die so badly, I'll kill you. There you go. What's that zombie doing? Is he trying to kill himself? Don't do that. Actually, you know what? Do that, zombie. No one likes you anyways. <laughs> All right, where's my bone meal? I have a little bit of bone meal. Yeah, let's bone meal these these carrots that aren't growing. Yeah, there you go. And these carrots over here should be growing here in a bit. <gasps> oh, I remembered. I need the cobblestone uh, the cobblestone walls. Oh my god, get away, zombie! Get away! Get away from my juicy, delicious crops! All right, all right. So we need... If I set up a wall, it'll need to be along this perimeter. Then we can set up all, all the way over to here. Right? Yes. And we can set this up. There we go. Alright. So this should be a pretty good perimeter for a farm. It should, you know, suffice. Should produce a lot of produce. Oh man, I'm so good at jokes. Ah oh, man, I'll be here all week. Or I'll be here for the rest of the episode at least. Actually, you know what? It could go out four more, right? Like, I don't need this water here. One, two, three, four. Then I need to put water here, right? Like, I think that's it. Now there's a burning zombie. Why is there a burning zombie? Is that not- is that not- Oh, that's a regular zombie that's coming out here. Oh! You guys aren't the special day zombies, are you? Yeah, you look at that. You dropped your head there and you're like a little dumb. Like a little dumb. Oh! <gasps> he dropped some shoes. Let's see. NSC UGF boots. These must be for the, uh... Futurecraft. Yeah, Futurecraft. It's gotta be from Futurecraft. God, I forgot my buckets. Where did I put them? Oh, I think I put them in the chest somewhere. Ugh. Well, anyways, I need to- I need to get some cobblestone. Actually, you know what? I don't even need to do that. There we go, got a bunch of cobblestone walls, no problem. What? More zo- Get out of here, you dumb day zombies! You get out! Get out! Ugh. There you go. Oh, Get away from my crops! I need these juicy, delicious carrots! Ugh. Ugh. Get away from me, torch. There we go. Alright. Okay, this should keep zombies out of here. At least until we can, uh... At least until we can finish it up and get some more cobblestone. I- I- Oh wait, we have some cobblestone here, alright. So, there we go, we got some more cobblestone walls. Ho ho, looks like you're not going to come inside anytime soon! Then I need to make a fence gate so we can come in and out, no problem. And right here is the front of it, okay. So there we go. Alright. And... Is that no, I think I need to make it one more block outwards. God, get out of here! D d dumb days, I mean, you guys never learn. I guess you don't have a brain because you're always looking for brains, but you always eat the brains because you don't have a brain because you're not smart enough to know that you have to put the brain in your head and think with it instead of eating it like a dumb... God, dumb zombies! Ah, uh, well... Let's see, do we have... Yeah, we have more dirt, okay. And we just need to keep working on this perimeter. And there we go. Oh, wait. Here we go. And the zombies will never get in and out of this place unless they're smart enough to open up fence gates in the future, which I hope they do not do that. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna have to worry about that anytime soon, though. Alright. This should be... There we go. And there we go, and there we go. Now, I just need a little bit more cobblestone, and I will be good to go. In terms of, uh, in terms of that. So... Huh. I'm gonna need a place to put this... This water, this infinite water pool, I'm gonna need a place to put that in the future. So maybe I'm gonna to have to... Huh, maybe move it into here somewhere? 
Just so it's safe? I don't know. Huh. So, two buckets. Yep, there you go. Uh, any- I guess I might as well start smelting some of the stuff in here. So we have a lot of iron, there we go, start smelting that. Uh, is there anything else I can smell? I guess not. I'm not seeing anything. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. Oh wait, yep, copper. There you go. Oh, there's some aluminum, so let's start smelting that. Now, can you smelt this gravel stuff? Oh yeah, okay. Okay, so you can smelt the gravel stuff the same way you can smelt, uh, smelt regular stuff, so. We have a little bit of coal there. Oh wait, I have some gold, some ferrous, some aluminum, some tin. Yeah, I'm gonna need, uh, I'm gonna need some more furnace eye. Let's get a few of these in here. Let's actually get a few of those. There we go. And I'm gonna need... I'm gonna need three. Yeah, just three. That'll be enough. No problem. And... Let's do that. That should be more than enough. Fence, or er, Gobblestone walls. And let's make ourselves a fence gate real quick. And sticks. And I think... Is this a fence? Yep, that's the fence gate. Okay. There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And let's actually break out a little bit of the wall here and place those three extra furnace eye. Like so. Start smelting this. Oh wait. Yeah, we need to smelt this one first. And put that in there. That's already in there. Okay, there we go. And we have some more stuff. Aluminum and tin there. So we need to get some more. There we go. Let's get this cooking. Oh, what'd I just do? Where's my coal? Oh, there it is. I don't know what happened to my coal right there. And let's get this cooking. And oh god, I need another one, you kidding me? Ugh, everything is cooking here. Eh, there we go. Alright, let's go upstairs. And let's finish our farm. And then we can finish this episode as well. Which I think is fine. I, I personally think this episode was fantastic in, in terms of uh, progress. Not gonna joke around. Alright, so that's... That's, uh, both of these are filled up nicely, so... We can, uh... Yeah, we need- we can extend that out to here, pretty sure, no problem. So let's do that, and break this, then we can put the- put the strip of water right here. Then maybe extend the farm a little bit more if we really need to, in the future, like if we really- If we really, really need that much more crops, which- uh, I don't think maybe- I don't think we'll need that much more room for crops, like, I, I think this should be more than enough. Is this- oh, that is clay, we can get some bricks, which I don't know why we'd use bricks, because we're not going to make a brick house. I don't, I don't think I- I think I made a brick house back in Minecraft beta, or at least I had a little bit of bricks to make a brick house, but I don't think I've ever made a brick house. I don't think anyone has ever- Leave a comment down below if you ever made a brick house in Minecraft, because... Pretty much every house I see is made out of wood, which is completely- Completely fine, by the way, but at the same time, like, I don't think anyone uses bricks because it's, it's kind of expensive while at the same time it, in a way, it kind of looks ugly as well. So, ah, leave a comment down below if you're one of the people out there who, uh, who has a brick house because I am definitely interested to know if anyone out there has a brick house because I don't think I've ever made a, I mean, like in Minecraft, not like in real life because I know in real life brick houses are quite common. I think I, I think my house is brick, so. That just goes to show how common brick houses are. Alright. Anyways, back to Minecraft. <laughs> let's, uh, let's keep spreading the water here. Yeah, there you go. And yeah, yeah, I hear you, zombie. I hear you making those nasty groaning noises. You're not coming in here anytime soon or ever. Ho ho! Ah. Uh, well, I need more dirt. Uh, I need to get rid of this. Dumb dirt. Yeah, look at you, zombie. You look pretty sour that you're never going to come in here. Ho ho! All right, let's get all this dirt. This should be more than enough to fill in that. Yeah, there we go. There we go. This is what I'm talking about. And then we can till all this and whatever all this is tilled. Oh, yeah, look at this. We can fill this in over here as well where we didn't get to finish it. Nice. Nice. Perfect. Wah! And, uh, I guess because we... Maybe lily pads don't exist, I guess, in place of lily pads, we can use, a uh, Carpet? But that would be expensive. You need to get a lot of string to get some carpet. Actually, not really. Carpet gives you... It crafts in like 16, right? Maybe like 8 or something too? I don't know, I'm not 100% sure. But, there we go. Do we have any crops we can just lay down? Maybe crops to harvest? Yeah, a little bit of... Little bit of carrots. Might as well get the carrots. Alright, zombies, I know you're hungry, but I'll never feed you. I'll never feed you my brains. Let alone my delicious carrots. Which I am so proud of. <laughs> They're like my babies. <sighs> well, that reminds me. I need to light this area up. 
Yeah, let's light this area up nicely. It's getting dark out as well. And I think it's going to be a good time to leave off. So thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. It really helps out and lets me know you guys are enjoying the series. So uh, I know you guys are enjoying the series as far as episode one is concerned, but I have recorded the past few episodes back to back. So be sure to let God, you dumb zombie <laughs> pushing me into my crops, getting rid of my carrot. <gasps> I'm so sour. Oh, man, as I was saying, leave a like down below if you guys enjoyed the video. And if you guys want more of these videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I'll put my latest videos on our YouTube homepage as soon as they come out so you don't miss this episode. But until then, thank you guys all for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more End of Earth. Where I guess maybe we'll start building our house above ground. Maybe go mining a little bit more. Maybe adventure above the ground a little bit more. Who knows? Leave a comment down below what you guys would like to see. Anyways, thank you guys all for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more End of Earth. Oh, bye there.